Hi, I'm back in the kitchen with the one, the only Massa from Asian Inspirations. Now, I believe we are cooking one of my all-time faves today, Massa. What is it? Yes, it's going to be a pork kakuni, a seamed pork belly, Japanese style. It's going to start off with just searing the pork. Okay. So that helps to just put all the juice inside the pork belly. So just roughly cut the pork belly. So little small pieces there of pork to begin with. Exactly. And what's the key ingredient of this one here, Massa? Today, the obento, sake, mirin, and the soy sauce. And pork only take a few minutes to cook? Or is it yes. a little bit longer? So we're just going to sear the outside. Okay. Most of the cooking will be done inside the pot. And what have we got here? That's gin ginger? Muscle? That's ginger right yep. there, yep. And then... That's the raw rice grains. So that's going to help the pork make it a bit more milder. It's like a secret ingredient to yeah. help the pork. And that's the leek right there. So when do we add those in? So I've got a bit of water boiling up here. Okay, right into the water. So we're going to put it in here, yep. together with these ingredients. And we're going to bring it to a boil. Once the pork's cooked through, I'm going to drain it out. Sounds good. I'm going to have a bit of paper towel here. Okay. Just to get the excess liquid off. Oh, smell that ginger. Beautiful. Well, it's a very well-known dish for winter. Yeah, actually. right. This is a bit of dashi stock here. Yep. Bit of mirin. Bit of mirin. So mirin, would you combine that with sort of the sake typically as well and, and soy sauce? Yeah, so what's special about these three sauces are, in Japan, in most hot pots and most sauce ingredients, they will have these three ingredients inside. Mm. And in Japan, we have a typical ratio for each kind of cuisine that you're making. Oh, there you go. So what I'm doing here is I'm just going to wipe off the excess liquid from okay. the pork belly. Yep. And then we're going to bring it into our sauce mixture. Okay. And because pork is so fatty, the ginger and the leek helped it to make it more refreshing. Right. And the rice also helps it to cut the bit of the pork belly fat as well. Is that right? Like I said, it's a secret ingredient. So this has been simmering for what, a couple of hours now? Yes, it has. Smelling good. Thank you very much. Good to go? Good to go. Right. So now we're just going to plate it. Get a bit of pork belly up. Get a nice bowl. It's a very good winter dish. It warms you up straight oh, away. Oh, I bet. Have it with um, a hot steamed rice. Beautiful. A bit of beer even. <laughs> I smell that ginger though. Oh. Bit and of carrot. also add a bit of yeah, vegetable inside for a bit of colour and nice. also a bit of texture. Fantastic. Wow. Can even go a little bit more fancy, add some boiled eggs in oh, there. Oh yeah, now we're getting serious. This is good. Cut, pour the sauce over the top. Add a bit of spring onion maybe. I think Finish you've done this touch. before, Massa. Wow. And there you have it, sir. Look at that. Your dinner. What a masterpiece. There's only one thing to do here, and that is to try this beautifully looking like pork. It. Wow. Soft enough there? Mmm. You weren't wrong. Nice and juicy. Those beautiful flavours coming through. Mmm. I'm glad. I was a bit nervous. You've done well. Thank you. You've done very well.